Keeping venomous reptiles is an unforgiving hobby, requiring proper training and lots of experience. One simple mistake can be the difference between life and death. death, death. Remember, the most venomous snake in the world oh, is the whoa. one that just bit you. There are no venomous snakes with training wheels. Just because you see Viper Keeper handle snakes a certain way does not mean you should try it too. <laughs> she was probably going to eat the mail. Ah, see, now you missed it. <laughs> yep, of course. Or my appearance startled her and... Now, there she goes. Oh, oh, she's very upset. Oh, there. <laughs> you took the food. Oh, away. look at the tail. Yeah, she's just pissed now. Yeah, she would have eaten the mail. You were absolutely correct. There you go. The one nice thing about that is I always get a happy death adder from her. Right? Huh? Are you a happy death adder now? Oh, yeah, I know. It's tasty. You need to go on a treadmill. Here, I to get back inside. That was funny. I never had a snake do that. Come up after I closed the window. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> well, I wanted to get, I wanted to elicit uh, some caught alluring and uh you did i did you can't see me i i am camouflage you silly snake okay let me uh, slide in from this side why I keep my distance here. There you go. She usually gives a happy death at her too. Is that good, huh? It is. There you go. Okay, now let me see if I can find... Uh, I know where the mail is. Give him some sustenance too. Hi, girly. There you go. Come on. There you go. I'm not going to bother you over here. I know. Now you're very excited. You can, she probably isn't going to ever let go of the mouse so you can come around the corner. Look at her head twitch. I'm a happy death adder. I got my tucker. Okay, now the male, the male's head, uh, creamsicle's back in here. I saw he, he was on top of her earlier today. Oh, good boy. There you go. They should make some cute babies. Well, they did. That's the that's the parents that produce all those nice babies. Oh, I'll make more. Thirty nine of them, huh, big girl? Wow. You're getting to be a big girl. Knock knock, Sandy, are you home? Uh oh, here <laughs> she here she's like she's biting the water dish already. Oh, got me a tail, got me a tail. I'll eat it, I'll eat it, I'll eat it. Uh, <laughs> and there it goes. Hey, look at the tail coming around to this side. Okay. <laughs> I got your tail now. I got your tail now. <laughs> 
Oh, she's funny. What? What was that? You don't catch rats in the wild behaving like that. Oh, really? Ooh. You're not eating either, huh? Oh, an ass spider! See, that was a response of having the rat face to face. She was like, get out of my face, you scare me. Uh, and as soon as I turned the rat around and it wasn't facing her, bam! Rats are very formidable uh, uh, animals uh, and uh, snakes in the wild really respect them. Uh, doesn't take much. One, grab the, grab the prey item wrong, it bites the spine, crushes the vertebrae, severs the spinal cord, it's a dead snake. Could lose an eye at minimum. You think you might want that? You were playing Huff and Puff the other night. Yeah, what was Ooh. that? What was that, huh? You can't catch mice that way. You have to get them the first time. I think Miss, Miss Crate would like this. Hi, Miss Crate. This is a big one. That's a big one. Ah. No. <laughs> Going for the tail. It looks like a snake. <laughs> no, do not, please do not try to eat that that way. It's mine, I'll eat it the way I want. <laughs> butt munch. That is, that's just not going to work with that size mouse. She's going to have to go around to the head side. Come on. Here. Alright. <laughs> She'll figure it out. Hopefully. What? <laughs> you gave somebody mice and not me? <laughs> oh, he's really looking hopefully at you. Look, see, I'm not even hooding. Please feed me. Uh, you got mice? No, I don't. That was, that was the last one there, bud. Now it'll give me even more reason. Even these guys are coming over. Ah. You smell something tasty. The Goodyear blimp there doesn't need anything. She's quite kicked back compared to the male. There you go. You're home. Uh, don't leave her alone. Uh, oh no, she was over my shoulder. <laughs> okay, I've got fresh water. I've been fed. I won't block it yet, but pretty much. They are so funny to watch. And they're off and running. <laughs> oh, you're hungry, huh? Well, let's uh, give you a soak and then we'll uh, Let's we'll see if you want to eat. Come on. This is a Bahia lance head. Little girly. Beautiful snake, huh? Um, she's got a, quite a bit of a stuck shed. So we're going to give her a uh, gentle uh, soak for a little bit. 
Um, actually, I'm going to get the green lid. <laughs> oh, they're trying to drown me. Oh, don't push the lid off, please. soak for a little while. Maybe she'll calm down and realize that uh, you know, she's not drowning or anything and uh, we'll use this time to tidy up her uh, cage a little bit. Uh, well, let's see. I did put all this nice foliage in but she crapped all over it. Yeah. She dumped that in with her. Let it soak. Well, that's a mess. So let me get to it while she's uh, she's a soaking. Can she settle? Oh, you pooped. Come on. Come on. There you go. There you go. That'll make you feel better. Oh, Gosh, she's pretty. Yeah, get back in your cage. Go ahead. Yeah, it's clean. She doesn't recognize it. Well, yeah, it's tidied up. It's not clean, but... Uh, you know, the leaves are in a different place. Uh, you don't have poop all over them. Yeah. Hi there. Oh, you're so friendly. You're so friendly. I know you bite me in a heartbeat. This is a very angry little cabino. It has no trouble, no hesitation at all, uh, being very pissy. But boy, look at that. Is that a pretty snake? I know, I see your pupil. I see that big pupil. You can't fool me. You want to bite. Have you been channeling perps lately? Huh? Or puff adders? You know, the Gaboon Rhino mix which is what this is, uh, you know, brings out really nice traits, but also really bad traits, like, you know, rhinos have a tendency to be a lot more pissy than gaboons, and definitely this one uh, has, uh, has a lot of rhino in it, uh, even though it doesn't have a rhino head or really a rhino pattern, but it's quite a lovely snake, it's just it is not your average gaboon. All the people that like to free handle gaboons, here you go. Here's your opportunity. <laughs> we'll see how well that goes. Uh, no question. Uh, uh, do you want to do gabino cam? Let's do gabino cam. Oh, <laughs> I didn't even get close to you. You did uh, your strike thing, huh? Oh, oh tag the camera. You want to try again? Huh? One more. Come on. Oh, good for you. She is a pisser. Uh, that's why on our cage we have this. Very pissy. Uh, just as a reminder that she doesn't take any prisoners. She'll bite the snot out of you. Okay, Mrs. Viper Keeper will now watch me play gaboon hockey because she doesn't cook very well okay now it's time to play gaboon hockey 
Are you gonna hook nice or are you gonna pull, flop all over the floor in every, every place possible? <laughs> uh, oh yeah, the wounds are really placid. Mm, this is the devil's spawn here. Come on. Come on, you gotta balance, otherwise you're not going back in your cage. Yes, we're not using our fingers to open and close that cage, that's for certain. You, do you think I forgot you, huh? I didn't forget you. Oops. <laughs> oh, I gotta get it out of the dirt. I don't want too much shake and bake. And the girl has the right idea. There's a minimum amount of shake and bake up there. It's actually pretty rare to see these guys out during the day. Uh, these are the horned pit vipers from Vietnam, Protobothrops cornutus. Um, their Vietnamese name is, uh, Fan, Fancy, Fancy Song Sai or something like that, uh, um, I just call them, uh, Vietnamese Horned Pit Vipers, uh, or generally by their, uh, scientific name, which is far more pronounceable to me than, uh, Vietnamese. People wonder why I call this thing the, uh, the deadliest snake in the collection because it means business 100% of the time. Uh, 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 calm down. This is not for you. There you go. That's for you. Basiliscus. That's got to be the single most word that I have trouble uh, uh, pronouncing. There you, there you are. Okay. Well, you got one. You want another? But I want you over here or over here. You know, I am just not going to open that door with your face there. There you go. Now on the other hand, C. 
See, she doesn't fear me at all because I hand raised her. Uh, this girl up here, though, is is rather fearful of me and frightened, even though I've done nothing to her. But uh, I don't know I got any small ones. She just shed. right now. I don't want to get her too upset because I don't want her coming shooting out of the cage. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah, after that. Here. Want this rat? Want to hit this rat? Come on. going to uh, wind you up because you would bite me. No, I'm not interested in being bitten. Okay, dude, you got your two. As I mentioned earlier, Elvis is in shed and doesn't seem to be really in the mood to come out and play even though his door has been open for a little while. I have yet to uh, uh, to do anything more uh, with this because A, I haven't been here and I've been traveling and B, I'm sort of in a quandary on what to do with this monster. It definitely means uh, rearranging the room to a great extent. Um, so I'm sort of figuring that out. Uh, you know, I'm just not quite sure exactly uh, what to do uh, and how to go about it. Well, I'm going to leave your door open. If you want to come out, you can come out. Other than uh, that, uh, uh, you can just hang in there and just get some ventilation. Hello, Elvis. Can we do this in a civilized manner tonight? Huh? See, uh, I don't have a lot of maneuvering room. Easy, easy. No, easy, bud, easy. Biting everything in sight. All right, you got the rat. Finally, who? Come on, you can't be that hungry. He thinks I'm going to take it, but I'm really not. He thinks it's sort of a game. Viper Keeper comes over and tries to steal my rat. Um, <laughs> I'm not going to do that. You have quite a collection of flies in your cage, though. Stop your huffing. I'm not coming in to take your rat. 